Love and light to my Geminis. This is Cherokee of Telem Tribe Tarot, and I am going to give you a general reading. Um, please keep in mind that this is a general reading, so it, the message may not resonate. So if you like something that is more specific, please don't hesitate to DM me on Instagram, Telem Tribe Tarot, send me an email, or however you'd like to communicate. Hell, you could put a comment and I can reach out to you. Um, so I'm going to get right into it. Um, I started recording this while I thought I was about two, two minutes in and realized that I didn't hit the record button. So I feel like right now, Gemini's, you may be experiencing a recent with the um, Five of Pentacles card because I had pulled the cards in the previous recording that wasn't recording. I also pulled the Six of Swords and the Three of Cups. So in the recent past, very recent, I'm talking about 24 to 48 hours or a week or two weeks, nothing more than 30 days. You may have experienced a situation where you were dealing with your thoughts on your own. Maybe with someone who's like a friend who you're not that close with, but you feel as though the relationship is a little strained due to money. Maybe you're keeping it to yourself that you feel like you're being taken advantage of. Or it could be that you're just keeping your finances private and you're having a little bit of a money issue. Um, I don't want to say issue, just maybe short on change and you're staying to yourself until you re-up, so to speak. I feel like some of you are even distancing yourselves from all the standard activities that you typically would do. Like, you know, some of you would like to, you know, randomly go to restaurants or to the movies or little activities that you keep yourself busy. You're kind of backing away from it because you just feel as though you're just not financially capable to do whatever it is that you want to do. So you're trying to be a little bit more um, mindful of the way that you're handling your finances and you're trying to change the way how you do things. Like you're used to doing things a certain way as if, you know, sporadically and just splurging on things because you got this extra income or maybe you had this same income and a bill fell off like maybe you got a you know, your phone bill got cut in half or something allowed you to have more fun so you just been dropping money you know like you've been tipping strippers and shit but that's not the case you wasn't tipping strippers it's just that you had more money at hand and you've been just you know spending it frivolously on little things people around you may be taking advantage of that or a person that you may you know, I felt that was a cool ass friend, maybe taking advantage of that. For some of you, it's not even tied to money. It's just you just not wanting to spend money frivolously, not having money issues per se, but just um, distancing yourself from your everyday um, routine to try to figure out how you want to transition to the next sector of your life. I feel like uh, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy is very, very um, is, is very rampant in your reading. Um, I feel like you may be trying to distance yourself from someone, but you don't really know how to say it. So you're just kind of like, you know, not responding as much. Um, you may be even just, you know, ignoring the person and that's really not the way to go spirit wants you to know that your honesty is what would be appreciated we all go through things where we feel as though we have to you know draw back a little bit into ourselves to figure out what the hell is going on why we why we feel this way or why we're reacting this way but you still have to keep the people in your life on point as to what you're going through so they won't feel a certain kind of way and automatically people are going to assign the way that you're treating them to how they're treating you they're going to think they're doing something wrong so honesty is definitely the best policy i feel right now you just want to get away um maybe you may feel like you want to escape maybe some of you want to escape from your monetary situation you might have debts while others of you you're fine monetary wise but you're just not spending money because you don't really feel like doing the normal shit that you typically do. You just want some different shit. And I feel like with this transition, you're just in a really uncomfortable place. And you're just trying to figure things out. You're walking into a new sector of your life. And it's unfamiliar for you. So you're just kind of drawing back. And that's okay. But make sure that you're being communicative with the people that you care about. If you don't give a fuck about them, you don't care how they you know, um, are affected by you kind of ghosting, not even ghosting, but just not speaking up as much because you're dealing with your own shit, 
then that's on you. But if you care about the relationships and the connections that you've made, that you've been man maintaining, and then all of a sudden just kind of flipping the script and not saying anything, then you should speak up and say, hey, I just need a little bit of time to process what the fuck I'm going through because I'm not sure what the fuck I'm going through. That's okay. That's respectful. Now, I feel like some of you feel a little wavy, like you're not really sure about whether you're coming or going because you're overthinking as usual gemini with your overactive mind having asses um i was gonna say ass but it's asses because it's a whole bunch of y'all some of y'all are just like you know i just want to i just want a change but i just don't know how to make this change so i think spirit is really saying to you that the change that you want is the change that you think about all the time. The thing that you always back burner is the thing that you want, but you're not putting enough work into it to see it take um, um, precedent in your life. With the Three of Cups card, if you just put some energy into actually doing rather than overthinking about what's going wrong and pulling away from the people that love and care about you, with the Three of Cups card, you'll have a celebration coming up in the near future. I'm talking about within one to two weeks. I feel like you're going to be uniting with an old friend or maybe the friend that you have been kind of distant, distancing yourself from due to the bad communication. I think it's just a misunderstanding um, or the people that you not, not necessarily distance from because there was a misunderstanding, but because you just wanted to deal with your own shit. You're eventually going to link up and be celebrating something, but you can't have you, 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 you can't treat people a certain kind of way and then get upset when they kind of react to the way how you're treating them when it's not so nice, Gemini. Um, I do feel also that you're reuniting with an old way of thinking. Maybe there was a part of you that you grew from and maybe someone in your life right now, heavy Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio energy is bringing that back out of you and you're trying to contemplate to figure out if you should even move forward with this friendship or this relationship or this partnership because it's bringing you back to a place that you've grown from. Um, Spirit wants you to understand that sometimes we double back because we never really learned the lesson to begin with. Or maybe you know better, but you're just, you know, stubborn. And it happens to the best of us because we are human. But understand that your quality of life and the things that you're going through is on account of every thought that you have. Your thoughts become actions. So if you're thinking yourself back into this way of doing things that was unhealthy in the past, naturally you're going to repeat history. History will repeat itself and then you'll be back to that present feeling of why am I not transitioning the way that I would like to? Why aren't things working out for me? Because you keep making the same mistakes twice. Um, I think the general message here for you, Gemini, is that you need to not overthink your situation and realize when you are repeating the the past you're allowing old energies to to come back in so maybe that person that you kind of did disconnect yourself from was someone that you needed to disconnect yourself from uh, maybe it's someone that you've been trying to disconnect from but because it's like a love hate relationship it's difficult and it's not as easy there's a lot of energies here that i'm touching on and it's, it's a little back and forth. And I hope, you know, the message resonates for someone and the message goes through for whoever needs it. But in short, I'm going to close this out for you, Gemini. If you'd like a more personal reading, you know, for me to elaborate on this more, you have specific questions, please don't hesitate to contact me. But at the end of the day, you're not going to get this Three of Cups energy until you disassociate from whatever energy it is that's causing you to relive a, a portion of your life that you grew from so i think that's the message all right so all the best gemini and i love y'all and i'll talk to you soon love and light tribe